there are going to be plenty of times this year in Pac-12 play that Tyler Huntley is going to have to do this. This is third and eight, and this is the first drive coming out of the second half for the University of Utah. And right here, you're going to see Devin Kafusi get a really nice inside spin move on Darren Paulo. Paulo has to do better. He absolutely has to do better. Gets a little bit too wide, leans a little bit too much on that spin move, and there's the pressure. Okay, so he, he knows that he's got to do better. Now, Tyler Huntley is going to have to hit these throws in order to sustain drives because you want to force Zach Moss, but every once in a while, you're going to get into some run blitzes, some TFLs, and you're going to have to hit one of these passes. And he does it under pressure. Find Solomon Ennis on the out route, and Solomon is covered up. I mean, absolutely great coverage here by BYU. And slaps at the ball. He holds the ball at the high point, secures it, get his feet, gets his feet down, and gets that first. That's a huge catch, and that's a big throw. And that's what, Utah fans, that's what you need to see. You need to be able to see a 15-yard out route. You need to be able to see Huntley under pressure, release a football with accuracy. And then you need to see these Utah receivers come down with it. That's D'Angelo Mandel right there. Got to... You've got to get your hips back. You got to get your hips back, and you got to patty cake on that defensive end shoulders, and then you got to power with that right foot that's back here. This right foot has to power forward, and you've got to be able to jam this guy down into the traffic. You can't let him do that. You're gonna there. There's gonna be better rushed ends in the Pac-12 than that. 